right now and um, if I put the dish, I just need only this with cows fresh, okay? That's what I'm using to prepare this vegetable with and good see. So I will be right back guys. I have to put the cow there, okay? Just have to put four feet, you have to go down. The cow leg have to go down. So that it will miss very well. Mm -hmm. So I have to put onions and everything there and close it off. So that is it. So guys. So here we add our salt, okay, just have to add a little salt and uh, uh, boiling mango cube, okay, and we have our ginger okay, powder, little of it, not just much, so that it will not be bitter, and uh, nutmeg, because of the aroma, I love it when I'm cooking my goosey soup. So, and my curry. This is the curry, okay. I love to put curry because of the aroma and my thyme, little of it. So, that is it. And how we have a uh, no okay no mangi okay cube just to use i will just use only one for the boiling of the meat so you can see that is it so then i add water okay you just add the water not much just a little after i add my onion okay so that is it then i add the water and close it so that it will boil very well to cook maximum like 30 minutes so i will be back so i am back let's open yeah so this is my goosey okay crayfish and grounded pepper so i've ground it already you can see i've blended it already so first of all, let's add a little oil. So you can see it's dropping. So I don't know. Just have to put this. Okay, you're seeing it. Okay. So I just put my oil right now. So I just have to pour this. This way. So. So you can cook your ogusi. There is different kind, different method how to cook ogusi. Okay, any type depends of how you need it. Depends of how you want to cook your ogusi. So I just want to use this remedy so that you can see the way I cook my ogusi. Okay, so you can see it right now. I'm pouring it. Inside the boiling, you can see it. I'm pouring it already. Okay, so this is how I cook my goosey water egusi okay you have to be water so i just want the egusi to look like this so let's open to look like this so i just put fresh fish i don't want to fry the fish guys okay you can see the fish must fry so to look like this yeah i think it's okay the oil is okay but if you know you need much, you can put. But for me, I don't need much. 
I did the meat is too much guys. I love eating meat a lot. It's not my fault. I'm sorry guys. <laughs> it's good to enjoy yourself, you know. Let me put the spinach, okay? If you want to put a little bitter leaf, you can still do that also. But now this is spinach. Okay, I'm putting spinach right now. So before I can add a little bitter leaf. Yes, so just have to put this spinach. Please, you will lower your gas because of the the goosey, you know, because some of the goosey, before you know, we started burning. So you just have to lower your gas or your stove. Okay, if you are in place that you don't use gas, so, so just leave it, okay? I will be right back. Let's close it for like five minutes and see. Okay, guys. It's open. Yeah, I think it's okay. You have met already. So, so you just have to stir it. Oh, so guys. Just so let's open. So, guys, this is the egusi. Okay, don't need much oil. You can see, and it's very test good. Okay, guys, very test test good. And you can see the vegetable, which is the spinach, just half done. Okay, if you want to enjoy this kind of egusi, just half done, not the leaf just overdone. No. So it's just like this. So if you need the one that you you want a lot of oil, you can you can do so. But for me, I don't need much. You guys know that, right? From time, I don't need much oil. So you can see it. I'm sorry, just the. So I'm done with my recipe for today. A goose soup. You can use this a goose to eat. Maybe. Amala, pounded yam, like gari. Mm -hmm. Use it to make or buy. Mm -hmm. And you can use starch to eat a goosey soup. I know many of you know about that. So you can use semo, pounded yam, amala, gari mm -hmm. to make. So what I'm going to use today is pounded yam. Mm, so I just want to show you this is my recipe for today go see soup. So thank you guys Thank you all so much for being there for watching my video for subscribing to my youtube channel May God bless you all one love to you. I love you all so much. Thank you. Have a wonderful day and stay blessed. Bye. Bye Ciao Bye